Alright guys, welcome back to another video and right now what we're going to be showing you is what my brother just got. He picked it up for 150 bucks, bought it off my mom. And here, just bring the camera over here. Alright, yep, right here. Alright, All right, this is what he got. Okay, it's a Eton, which is like a spinoff of Honda. Sport 50, 50 cc's. Uh, here. This is, is the dash on it. It's got an electronic dash, only 100. Seven, or only 197 miles on it, and it's got 50 on the speedometer. But we're gonna be going way past that, hopefully. Yeah. So when you bring it back out here, you can see. I mean, this thing is. I don't know if this thing is considered supermoto because it's got the front end. <laughs> and you see, it's got those aggressive tires on it. Yeah. I'm gonna put noddies on it. Maybe. I'm gonna be putting noddies on it. Um. Coming to the back here, you got this nice little uh, kickstand that you put up, or you got, or you just got the original one that you can put down with your foot like this, just like that. And then you put it back up like that. But we have it on that one now. It's got this nice kickstarter right here. I haven't used it because it has electric start on it, but uh, yep, that's that. And uh, all the blinkers and stuff work. Everything works as is. It's uh has been sitting for a while so today was the first day we got it out and like it was like years. it was like literally uh it was like literally snow on the ground and we had to bring it up top from the barn so we shoveled out a path and we brought it down uh down here in the garage so we could get the battery hooked up on the trickle charger over there and we had to use this battery charger first because the battery was completely dead it had like no juice in it no nothing so we put it on 20 amp and it'll roll over yeah and it starts too it starts as well yeah it um, didn't start as first it didn't start as first at first because we took this off right took here the, took this off cleaned out the air box cleaned out in here and then we had the pull the we had the what we have to do yeah. we pulled the seat well we just picked it up like this and it's got all this nice yeah. storage underneath here is the carburetor and uh, there's your on and off. Alright, so what we did when we came under here was we took this off right here. You just got to take that out. We took actually the whole entire thing off. You got to take those bolts One, two, off. and then these four. Like that. And then we took out the spark plug, clean the ends of the spark plug, and then she finally rolled over. We, uh, it, it does have a little bit more than a half a tank. It's probably like right there. But this thing should be saving me a, a lot of gas now. That gas is almost like four and a half dollars. Four dollars and thirty cents. But yeah, I mean, we're just gonna get a couple shots of Trader on this thing to show him, show you guys just really how good he's gonna look while riding this. Yeah, this and also, um, the brakes were sticking up here, so we bled them. Had to take that little bleeder off right there, loosen that up, pump the brakes, put it back on, pump them, and then had to do it again. But now, front tire is working good. Basically, we did everything. We're gonna change the oil on it. The gas in here is ancient it's been sitting forever yeah so we were planning on changing the oil putting new gas in it and uh putting a new battery in it because as you can see this one's uh dead right now but uh yeah Travis gonna film me sitting on it and uh what you guys are gonna be seeing on the channel here in the future so this thing should be pretty nice in the summer it's got working headlight once i get the and knobbies on it and, and working blinkers too so just in case Travis following me in the field car he can see what he's doing in the field also also, I don't know if you guys, which I, you guys haven't seen it yet, but uh, Trader's Field Car, the Ford Escape. I actually got a new one, too. It's, I'm not going to show you guys yet because it's going to be in a near future video once all the snow melts because we got it out. But it's going to be in a near future video. Maybe in the next video we'll show you guys a sneak peek of it. Um, so, 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 anyway. All right, this is me sitting on it. As you can see, it has that nice cargo back, cargo rack in the back, just in case I wanna. Okay, so basically it has this nice cargo rack, just in case I wanna put like a gas tank or anything on this, but I shouldn't, cause these things are nice, hopefully fuel efficient. But uh, it's got this extra weight or uh, room on the seat here, just in case I pick up any chicks. Um, all right, so right now, without further ado, we're gonna clean this thing. We got some of that Lucas oil stuff over there, and we're just gonna clean it off. So it's all ready to go. Let me get it out. It is pretty dirty right now. It is pretty dirty. It's all dusty and stuff. So, yeah, we're just going to 
get her all nice and cleaned up. I mean, it's just this easy. It didn't start eating up the paint yet. Boom. And just like that, it's all sparkled up. There's Except no, for the seat. The seat kind of cleaned up. There's no point in doing that because it's just going to get even more dirty. Same with down there. But as far as the graphics go, I mean, let's get, let's get a front end look at this. Oh, yeah. Looking good. All right. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, be, except, be expecting more of the, what is that called? Le scooter? Yeah. Scooter, scooter videos in the future. Um, and, yeah, same with the field car. But just it's not uh, just when it's not three feet of snow in front of it or behind it or on both sides of it. Um, but yeah, same with this thing. Once the uh, once all the snow melts, we'll be getting this thing out and maybe getting knobbies for it. So maybe yeah. the knobbies might be before it. But we'll just have to see how good it goes, like in the field, I guess. Yeah. So uh, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next one.